What's up, YouTube, and what you know, my name is Domino with the Zero, and welcome back to Pokemon Crystal, the completely randomized Nuzlocke, episode number 28. 28. In the last episode, which was yesterday, uh, we finished up Team Rocket and Goldenrod, smacking them up. Our team did not fall at all. And then we came and took on this wise trio and just kind of just destroyed them. Um, so in today's episode, we're going to be going to meet Suicune here in the Tin Tower. And then I think we're going to head over to the Ice Path. I don't think we're going to do the Tin Tower today. Um, I think we're going to save the Tin Tower for another day. Um, but that's kind of the plan for today. So if you're excited for more Pokemon Crystal, go ahead and hit that like button. Subscribe if you're new. And if you enjoy the video, share the video with a friend. So let's quickly do a team recap. So, ooh, we are hurting. <clears throat> so first up, we have Lotus Lost, the Electric Psychic Hound Doom with Pound, Payday, Spike Cannon, and Nightmare. And okay stats all around. Then we have Uriel, our Ice Normal Type Mew, holding the Amulet Coin, the Flamethrower Cut, Fire Blast, and Hyper Fang with, again, pretty good stats, especially that defense and speed. Then we have Sarah, the Grass Poison type Dragonite, holding the Twisted Spoon with Strength, Rolling Kick, Dizzy Punch, and Octazooka. Good stats as well, especially Defense and Special Defense. Next, we have Goliath, our Electric Dawn Fan, holding the Amulet Coin with Horn Drill, Sludge Bomb, Shadow Ball, and Surf, with good stats, especially that Special Defense. And lastly, I believe we have Ezio, our Normal Ice type Tangela, with Shadow Ball, Rapid Spin, Fly, and Flame Wheel, with pretty bad stats, minus that defense, which is pretty good. Speed's not bad either. So that's just a quick team recap. Now we're going to go ahead and run back here. Ooh. Quick team recap for the day. See if we can be productive today. Now, um, we do have a new microphone set up today. Uh, I moved my microphone to try and see if it will cut out the, the boominess. Um, that we experienced. So let me know if you notice a difference. All right. Also, whatever the question of the day is right below me, make sure you answer it in the comments below. Okay. I'm excited. I'm excited. Let's play some Pokemon. It's a Flaffy. I mean, it's really not bad. It'll evolve the next level. Oh no! Okay. That's ice. Pound was super effective, so it's a dark type. So I'm going to hit it with Payday. Stop, stop, stop! I got a crit! Ah, I wanted to catch it! I wanted to catch it! Dang it! Awesome! Too awesome, even! I've never seen a battle that great. That was truly inspiring to see. Suicune was tough, but you were even more incredible, Domino. I heard Suicune's mystic power summons a rainbow-colored Pokemon. Maybe, just maybe, will cause that Pokemon to appear. I'm going to study the legends more. Thanks for showing me that fantastic battle. A later, Domino. So what, according to legend, when the souls of Pokemon and humans commune from the heavens descends a Pokemon of rainbow colors. Could it mean that the legendary Pokemon are testing us humans? Oops. Uh, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Oh my god, that is such a long text. When the brass tower burned down, three nameless Pokemon were said to have perished. It was tragic. However, a rainbow-colored Pokemon, in other words, Ho-Oh, descended from the sky and gave new life to three Pokemon. They are Suicune, Entei, and Raikou. That is what they say. The two towers are said to have been built to foster friendship and hope between Pokemon and people. That was 700 years ago. 
but the deal still remains important today. Or did it say the ideal? Alright, um... Well, I guess that's a way to prevent me from doing the Tin Tower now. They just don't even make the stairs available. I'm kind of upset that we didn't catch that. That was kind of a... It's kind of a lame start to the day, but that's alright. That's alright. That's alright. I love that music. I didn't realize that that was also the Ecritique City music. Or did I? I thought that was just the Cyanwood City music. I guess they recycled it. But anywho, let's go ahead and continue on. Oh god, leave me alone. I was wondering why she didn't... She wasn't on there right when I started, so... Uh, so as we said, since we can't do the Tin Tower, there's really only one other thing to do. Wait, I don't think I battled this guy. Who's our lowest level? Who's leading us? Ezio? How about Ezio pop up in front? Ooh, I wish we could have caught that, because it could have probably gone straight on the team. Let's go with our Rapid Spin. You know Rapid Spin is broken. Our team is pretty strong. I'm pretty happy with our team. I am pretty happy with our team. Oh! Wow, ah, okay. So she, she bought us something, so it could be a Master Ball, and that's why we're going to check, and we can heal. Oops. I don't know, it's withdraw. She bought me... A, no, wait. She didn't buy me PP up. So she bought me something that we already have. Maybe a... No, we had two King's Rocks. Maybe a Sharp Beak? That's probably what, that's probably what it was. It was probably a Sharp Beak. Alright, let's go, let's go, let's go! Ooh, Ice Path! I love the Ice Path! The question of the day will probably be something like, what is your favorite area? Did I already do that? <laughs> I'll double check, but it might be something like, what's your favorite area in Johto? And I think Ice Path is mine, and this is going to be our first encounter in the Ice Path. And it's a Pidgey. Now, as you can see, I'm going to call Pidgey as a Dupes Clause. And my headphones are doing that thing again. Okay, I'm gonna call Pizzy as Dupe Clause. Du wow. What were the words that even just tried to come out of my mouth? I'm going to call Dupe's Clause on that. Oh my gosh, these headphones. I'm gonna go crazy. It's like shifting. Every couple seconds it shifts to one ear and then it goes back to the middle and then shifts and then goes back to the middle. So Pidgey was actually Ezio evolved into Pidgey at some point. Uh, during our grinding montage. I don't know if there's... I mean, I know where to go, but I don't know if there's like a hidden item somewhere. Okay, there's not. So let's uh, let's do this correctly this time. Uh-oh. I'm a liar. Okay, hold on. I have to I have to make up for how bad I looked in a couple episodes ago. No, that's not right. That's not right. So it's got to be this way, and then how about this way, and then this way? I mean, it's not meant to be difficult. Or maybe it is, I don't know. Alright, that should be it. What? Hold on, where do I need to get to? I need to get to that rock, which means I need to go up to there, and I can't. Okay, hold on. Alright, so I need to get to the other side of this rock. Oh, duh. That was embarrassing. I talk all this stuff. Ooh, a Machoke. That's our first encounter. But Machoke is also dupes. And the reason I don't want to do it, like, you know... I know that, like, I don't have a Pidgey on the team, but the thing is, I know what Pidgey's going to evolve into. Alright, cool. We found a waterfall, and we're going to need that for sure. Uh, but, you know, I already know what that line's going to end up being. Or wait. Armachamp died. No, that was Sophronia. Sophronia got to Ponyta. Ponyta died. Okay, so we'll have to remember that. Headphones, come on. I think it's just this cable. I think this cable is going bad, so I might have to re replace this cable, which I could do. That wouldn't be a problem. Alright. Let's do this real quick. We're still waiting on our first encounter. I think uh, if I do this, and then that, 
And then that. Okay. Boulder fell through. Wonder foul. How about we push this one down a bit? Evaluate our situation. Okay, we're gonna go up, up, over, 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 down, around. Anyway, I really like the ice path because this was kind of like where Sneasel was first seen. So I think it's like my favorite now, but I I always kind of like this these ice puzzles. Uh, I also liked in Gen 6 and XY, they, kinda, they brought back ice puzzles, but they made them better. A Doduo, that is not dupes. Okay, great. So here's our first encounter. I don't think I have anything to hit it. Let me think, let me think. I don't have status moves in this game. I didn't really go for too many status moves. So uh, what we're gonna have to do is you're a doe duo. Stay in the Pokeball. Stay in the ball. Oh god, you're not gonna stay in the ball. Oh, that's super effective. You won't get a crit. Powder Snow. All right, let's go up to a Great Ball. Boom! All right, hold on. I gotta pull this up. I gotta pull this up. I haven't used this in a long time. Random name generator. Right there. And then we go masculine, because it's a male. First name only. All right, we have Doduo, the twin bird Pokemon. It lives on a grassy plain where it can see a long way. If it sees an enemy, it runs away at 60 miles per hour. And his name is, his name is quite simply, Fred, the Doduo. Let's check out Fred real quick. We have Fred, the poison type doe duo with leech life, powder snow, dream eater, and submission. And extremely low stats all around. So Fred is going to be added to the team just because we don't have four spots. Um, or we don't have all our spots. What? Four spots? We don't we didn't have all of our spots filled. Now we do, and I don't have too many potions. Alright. Let's not mess up. Because we are not Shofu. In fact, we are intelligent and good at Pokemon puzzles. Unlike Shofu. Uh, now we want to... Oh, obviously we have to go this way. Evaluate. Okay. I think we have to push this way. And then push this way, this way, that way. Boom! That's how professionals do puzzles. Take notes, Shofu. Take notes. All right, now, how do I get where I'm going? Boop, boop, boop. Done! Look at this! It's no thing. It's no thing. All right. Just kind of checking our time, seeing where we're at, because I think we're almost already out of this cave, which is kind of cool. A Wobbuffet? We don't care about no Wobbuffet. We don't need to do no... We definitely don't need to do grinding. All right, I think all that's here is an item. Yeah. A mint berry. What is up with all these mint berries I'm finding? Okay, let me go this way first so I can get the item that's down here. A ferret. Maybe Doduo was like the best Pokemon that we could have ran into because it evolves. Alright, I need to go this way. <sighs> Truth be told, I didn't mean to do that. I did not mean to do that! This microphone being where it is right now is actually like throwing me off. Oh! Okay, I don't know what I was thinking. Alright, let's go this way. Are you serious? Did that actually just happen? Arcanine? We had an Arcanine. What happened to it? I know it died, but how did it die? Really? I have to go all the way around after getting the item? No, I didn't have to. I could have just gone up, ran into that, and then gone over. Anyway, all right. I do believe this is like the last floor. <gasps> okay. That used to be something important. What did that used to be? That used to be like the never melt ice? Is that right? I think that used to be the never melt ice. Hardstone. Rip. Okay. Super potion. That's good. 
We have made it to Blackthorn City. What's this like? Wow, you came through the ice path? You must be a real hotshot trainer. Oh, okay, I thought she was like... I thought she was like a... Um, not serious. Parasect's cute, but I don't have it. Do you have a Parasect? Do you want to trade for my Croconaw? If I had a Parasect, sure. I do not have a Parasect, though. Sorry to let you down. Sorry to let you down! Alright. Nah, Pokemon Center people don't give you anything in these games. So, what could we do right now? I'm trying to think of what... Like... Oh my gosh, look at all this money I have. I'm gonna buy 25 Hyper Potions. I'm gonna buy 10 more... No, 10... 10 more of those. And that's it. Alright, now I should deposit some stuff. Just so, just cause. I'm kind of in the habit of depositing stuff. I don't need Hardstone. I don't need Focus Band. Focus Band is stupid in this game because it doesn't heal everything. Alright, uh, let us... That's the move deleter's house. I don't need to go in there. I'm not ready to take on the gym. We'll do the gym in the next episode. But since we're only about 16 and a half minutes in, or 16 minutes in, I guess, let's go ahead and see if we can get more encounters. So who can we trust? Ezio kind of proved that we can't trust him, but uh, we'll go ahead and do it anyway. Ooh, we found a wild Dratini. Okay, now, uh, all of these moves are too strong. Wait, no, it wasn't Ezio that proved disproved himself. It was uh, Lattice Lost. Anyway, let's go into Fred. Rock slide. Trying to think if Leech Life would be a bad idea. I don't think so. Wow. That's amazing. That's amazing. I don't have any Ultra Balls? Wow, I don't need any Ultra Balls. Okay. I am going to go purchase some Ultra Balls right now, though. Okay, so we have Dratini, the dragon Pokemon. It sheds many layers of skin as it grows larger. During this process, it is protected by a rapid waterfall. What? What? That doesn't make any sense. His name will be Oscar. I would say Oscar, but it's not ER, it's AR, so it's Oscar. All right, let's check out our Oscar uh, withdraw. Let's check out Oscar. The flying steel type Dratini with rock slide, wrap, poison sting, and karate chop, and pretty low stats. So what I might do, since I have the, um, I'm trying to think. Since I have the, uh, the lucky egg, I might potentially add Oscar to our team. Um, I might train him up and see what we get from him. So let's go ahead and uh, let's take on some trainers. Now, I'm not going to raise Ezio because if one of our new guys winds up growing to something cool, Ezio is going to get replaced only because, you know, he has rapid spin, so he's good and all, but um, Uriel, or Uriel is the same type. They're both normal ice. They're both normal ice. So I don't feel the need to have both of that. Because if we go against a fighting type, we're we're actually going to die. What what move is this? What what type is this guy? Of course, ground type is always super effective. It just missed something, and I, I'm not sure what it was. That's a little scary. Uh, I need to fly back because I'm poisoned. So let's see if we can make it through these routes today. Uh, let's go off to the right side. Battle this guy. Machamp! Can your Machamp handle a Fire Blast? Yes, it can. Okay. Uh, can your Machamp handle a Cut? No, it can't. Alright, Pidgeot. Alright, for Pidgeot, I'm going to send in... Lattice Lass. Why? Because I knew that that wouldn't do very much damage. I also clicked the wrong the wrong move. 
And I'm trapped. Okay, this is how Lattice last dies. Or, La this is how Lattice last dies. Oh, okay. I almost said if he misses, he's dead. I almost said it. Let's go ahead and heal there. I think we have a super potion. We do. And let's just use a full heal instead of running back. All right, let's continue on. Let's continue on. I think there's one more route or something. I know. That's frustrating. Speed up button. Death by speed up button. Outrage. Woo! It does a lot. Piloswine. Takedown. Super effective. Hold this fire blast. That did no damage. It actually did no damage to me. He's doing the same amount of damage to him in recoil that he's doing to me. Uh... I feel like I, I knew what type to use. Alright, I'm gonna see if we can... Alright. Now I actually need to fly back because I'm an idiot. Might as well heal since I'm here, but I'm an idiot and I didn't get the item. Which is very frustrating because I have to fly back... Uh, uh, is it this way? Okay. Max Elixir. Ezio, fly me. See, these are the kinds of things that I could do in a grinding montage. Um, but I've since decided that we're just going to have them in the episode because I think it's a lot more fun that way. Another Dratini. I wonder what Dratini evolves into. Does he evolve at level 30? I'm pretty sure it's level 30, so we'll find out in the grinding montage. And depending on what it is, I might just stop training it from there, or I might continue training it. I, I, I really don't know. Also, I should probably switch off of Ezio, or uh, excuse me, off of Uriel. Uriel doesn't love these people. Uriel doesn't love these people. All right, let's switch off, because we're level 39 now. Let's switch to, uh, let's let Goliath have some fun. I don't use Goliath often because he's broken. Um... He has his little randomized... Ooh, did I make the right choice? Kind of. I do need to fly back and go down that route. But that's why we're speeding stuff up. Leftover. Ooh, 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 ooh. That's a good item. All right, who wants leftovers? Ladislas, you want leftovers? All right, Ladislas is going to hold on to leftovers for now at least. All right, let's go ahead and battle as many people as we can. About 23 minutes in. That's all right. Not very effective. Ice is not very effective. Is dragon... Dragon is also not very effective. What is not very effective? Is that ice type? That would make sense. That would make sense, wouldn't it? That would make sense, wouldn't it? It has counter? All right, whatever. Just die. Uh, This thing is... Oh, I didn't... In my mind, all I saw was that it was a, a psychic attack. I forgot which psychic attack it was. You know, I, I don't I don't like to use uh, horn drill. I think it's hilarious that we have this one hit KO move. If I wanted to, I could literally just run through the rest of the game. Don't paralyze me. No, I don't appreciate you paralyzing me. I missed. Mimic. That's not even funny. Sent out Kingler. All right, I'm gonna full heal, mid battle, mid battle full heal. Maybe there's a first time for everything. All right, shadow ball, earthquake, sludge ball, magneton. Hold this. Oh, he has extreme speed. I remember when extreme speed used to give us trouble. All right, uh, let's go. I wanna, I'm gonna forget which way I went. All right, route 46. So wait, is this the same route from the beginning of the game? Like when I jump down, okay, this says route 45. This says route 46. So is this the, okay. Woo, these trainers. Level 19. Oh, you can probably get to this part through the dark cave. You can probably get to this part through the dark cave, so. Uh, that's interesting. That's interesting. Why did that give me so much experience? Oh! Hair- Heracross! I miss our Heracross! Alright, so this is Route 46, but this is the beginning. Okay, great. So, let's fly back. 
And now, let's see if we can remember which way we went. Uh, I don't remember at all. Slowbro would have been cool to get. Slowbro is super strong. All right, if I remember correctly, I think this is the way to the first item, and we got that. So now we're just running into a million and a half Pokemon. So we did not go this way, right? Okay. Hopefully you can get everything in two runs if you remember where stuff is. Like if you remember where you've already been. That's what we're, that's what we're hoping for. Leave me alone. It was a mistake to get that girl's phone number. It was a mistake. All right, just a couple more trainers and we'll be all done. Oh crap. Last time we saw a Mewtwo, there was death involved. You know what? I'm not taking any, oh god. You know what, I don't need to do that. I don't need to do that. I don't need to cop out. It's only level 28, what am I scared of? Goliath is broken. How did I get to level 40? When did I get to level 40? What? If I'd have realized that, I would have switched a long time ago. All right, Sarah. I feel bad for these other people. Like, these people didn't do anything, and now they have to deal with Sarah. Okay, that's it. They lucky. They lucky. Nobody had to deal with Sarah. All right, let's heal up real quick. How about we end the episode, because I forgot. How about we go over here? Wait, isn't this a... Uh... Okay, no. I was trying to remember where the super rod is. Do we not get the super rod until, like, Kanto or something? Because what I think we're going to do, we haven't done this in a while. Oh, wait, I need to buy Ultra Balls. I said I was going to buy Ultra Balls, and then I forgot to buy Ultra Balls. Let's buy, like, 25. Sure. All right, great. That should be enough to catch anything in this game. Whoa. Whoa. Eh. Eh. All right. We're going to lead with Fred. And we're going to go over to our items. I only have the old rod? No, I have the good rod right there. Okay, great. Let's... We haven't fished in a very long time, so let's fish for our last encounter. All right, here we go. Let's figure out what it is, and then we'll decide what our team might be. The dupes of all dupes. Jeez. That's Sarah. Some power... Okay, that's a little ironic. Uh, here, can I? Oh, stop. Controller, please, when I click, you gotta click. All right, boom. 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 A Kingler. We've already had one of those, too, and it died as well. All right, let's surf. Ooh, a nine tails. A level 10 nine tails. Okay. So, Fred, can you do anything? I don't think so. I don't think Fred can even touch this thing, or it'll die. Oh, so close. It'll stay, it'll stay, it'll stay. That's it. You just have to believe in it. You just have to believe in it, and it'll stay every single time. So let me change this over to feminine. All right, we caught nine tails. The fox Pokemon. It is said to live a thousand years, and each of its tails is loaded with supernatural powers. Nine tails is a scary Pokemon. What is this name? Okay, so... Gobahar. Is that a female name? Forgive me for my uh, ignorance, but is that a female name? All right, let's quickly check out our, our Galbahar. I guess Gal. All right, Galbahar. Stats. The electric type Ninetales, so it will not be added to the team. Absolutely no way. Leech Seed, Thunder Waves, Ember, and Scratch. So... Gabahar will not be added to the team unless something happens to Goliath, because Goliath is a pure electric type. Um, so we have no need for that. But that is going to do it for today's episode. In today's episode, we started off by uh, by meeting Suicune, which was a Mareep, and we accidentally killed it, which I didn't mean to. I probably should have spent a little extra time and actually caught it, because it would have evolved the very next level, and that would have been cool. It would have been strong. Uh, but then we made our way through the ice path, catching a Doduo. 
And then we got to Blackthorn City, went south and caught a Dratini. Finished up all of that route. And then we just caught a uh, Ninetales. So in the next episode, which will be tomorrow, I think we're going to take on the Blackthorn Gym. Um, and then we'll see where we go from there. That'll probably take the whole episode. So if you enjoyed today's episode, go and hit that like button. Subscribe if you're new. And we will see you tomorrow. Oh, before I say that, don't forget, whatever the question of the day is right below me, make sure you answer it in the comments below. Let's see if we can get, I don't want to start doing goals or anything like that. If you, if you enjoy and you see that comment below me, go ahead and answer it in the, in the comments below. And we will see you tomorrow for more Pokemon Crystal, the completely randomized Nuzlocke. Until then, have a blessed day.